everyone welcome back to a brand new vlog so i've just finished filming a main channel video if you recognize the background i don't know if the video would have gone up first or the vlog gone up but i did just finish filming a video but today it is friday and this is going to be a very special vlog that I'm really, really excited for. If you guys watched my, I wanna say it was Christmas day vlog, you would know that I surprised my nan and my mum and one of our best friends, Pam, with a trip to London to go and see Mamma Mia on West End. Well, tomorrow is the day that we're actually going. So we're traveling up Saturday morning, we're staying in a beautiful hotel tomorrow night, and then we're gonna spend the day there Sunday before we come home. And it has been maybe three, well, actually it's been quite a few years since my mum last went to London, and obviously because Atticus is staying at his dad's it's our first girls weekend ever my nan hasn't been to London in what I want to say is like 10-15 years I think and then Pam as well I don't know when the last time she went to London Pam is basically family at this point she is my nan's best friend but we absolutely love her and it's always been her dream and on like her little bucket list type thing to go and see a West End in London because we all love going to the theatre so I just thought for Christmas I know everyone will love it I just want to do something nice and surprise them all so I told everyone everyone the name of a specific hotel and then I actually went and booked something completely different because I didn't want anybody to google it. I've actually booked for us to stay at a apartment hotel called Shovel Three Keys and I got us the Studio Deluxe room which is I think one of the nicest rooms you can get and it's basically an apartment so you get a living room, you get a massive kitchen, you get like a massive hallway. I think I got a two bedroom one, both bedrooms have got an ensuite and then you've got a separate bathroom as well. It is literally the most unreal apartment and the best thing about it is the view that is going to be one of the surprises when we get there they're literally not going to be able to believe it because i told them that we were staying in a nice hotel but like nothing like this and then i also told them we were going to get a taxi there and a taxi back and we're obviously getting a taxi back instead of having to get the train but i went a step further and i actually booked a limo now that is why i had to tell my mum because i needed my mum to go and print out the booking confirmation for me and obviously mum was going to look on it and be like oh my god you booked a limo so my mum knows and i told her last night but my nan and pam have absolutely no idea so i booked a limo and it's a white ford excursion limo i want to say i honestly don't know which one it is but it's a white limo it seats between eight and twelve people and we've got a food and champagne package as well but my nan booked us a limo to go somewhere when i was maybe six or seven years old like all of our family weren't there was maybe like 15 of us going and we all went and had an amazing night and like i said my nan booked us a limo now that i've booked a limo for my nan like she is literally not going to believe it like you were saying as well weren't you yeah how shocked my nan and pam are going to be they, because they honestly, think i can't that we're just getting a normal taxi and then we're just going to stay in like a nice hotel but like not a nice nice hotel have you so, told them where we're staying have you i've told them where we're staying i've explained the whole situation and then we're going for a really nice dinner and then we're going to see mamma mia on west end and now we're going to go to tesco because the next morning because obviously we have a kitchen i'm going to do like a big table spread for everyone so i'm going to do like fruit i'm going to do like croissants like pan of chocolates and stuff and then i'm also going to cook a full english we're talking like eggs tomatoes bacon mushrooms toast tea everything like i'm literally going to do like a big breakfast spread because i think we can stay there until 12 and all of us tend to wake up at like 7 a.m so like everyone wakes up really early who we're going with I'm don't they mum wakes up at five nan sometimes wakes up at four and goes and does her keeps fit outside but i, I certainly like, won't pam be getting up, up at five. five no we can have a lay and pam wakes up at like mum will be and... doing her keep fit on the balcony Anna. yeah i know she will nan, nan my nan bless her she does this keep fit and she does like a hundred star jump she does like a hundred i don't know what she yeah, does but she, she does, really yeah. goes for it so she can do that in front of the river thames which she's going to be so excited for so we're now going to go to tesco and we're going to buy or the food and then i'm gonna have to obviously they're gonna wonder why i'm bringing so much food tomorrow so as soon as we get into the limo i'll tell them why we've picked up some flowers i've got this for nan and pam and then we've got some fruit we're just buying all of the fruit to do a little fruit platter with should i get mango chunks yes, or should get I get, yeah i like mango actually oh, so we'll cool. get one of those and then what should i oh, get kiwi, kiwi, kiwi and, yeah. and strawberry melon. or do i get oh okay should i just get a strawberry melon then yeah. i don't think we're gonna want much I more than that plenty. yeah that's four different fruit. fruit ones and i can put them all in a bowl little like fruit salad thing i think then we should just get one of these instead no, of getting got, got, instead of getting here, the kiwi you've got no i think that's decisions not, okay yeah, stick with them 
All right then, we'll sit with the, oh, but that's nice as well, look. Pear, apple and grapes. Here's an update on the trolley. We have bought a lot of the breakfast stuff. We've got croissants, eggs, bacon, sausages. Also got my nan and Pam a little present and I've got mum some flowers as well. And that is pretty much it. And I got some crisps as well. Need to get some dip and we need to get Pringles. All of us are literally obsessed with pink gin and we've just found these pink gin sets and you get the two proper glasses. You get a like a shot's worth of pink gin and then you get the little berries and stuff to put on top. So we're gonna get two because there's four of us. <laughs> there we go, in here. Mum's oh, excited. I, I am really blessed. Mum hasn't had a drink for how long? Six years. Six years, there I we go. No, I have a sneaky, no. What? You had a sneaky? I have a sneaky J2O. At home. You are pushing the boat out, Mum. We finished the food truck, we just come out of Tesco and we got all the gin like I showed you. We're so excited about that gin. It's ever since on Mum's birthday when Nan tried the gin for the first time, she just fell in absolute love with it. Pam texted me the other day and said, we'll have a couple of gins cheersing to your Nan. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. The glasses are beautiful. And we've got yeah. flowers, everything, I'm very, very excited to surprise them all with it. Good morning everyone. So today is the day of London and last night I got a message from Sinful Delights and she was asking if we wanted any desserts to take away to London. So she made this rocky road for Pam. She made this brownie for my nan. And obviously got my nan's name written on it. And then she made me and my mum this like sweet box to pick at. So there's everything in here. So thank you so much. Everyone's gonna love it. Suitcase is packed. I'm taking my laptop even though I don't think I'm gonna need it. I've got two Two different outfit options for tonight. I know which one I'm gonna wear. I'm just taking one as like an absolute backup. I've got a couple of bits I need to take pictures of whilst I'm there. I've got my Chanel bag to take because I only take it out on really special occasions and today's a really special occasion. Makeup bag, hairbrush that's disgusting. I've got my face wash. I've got some scrunchies, face mask. I've got my handbag just here to take and then these are the presents that I've done up. These are nannies and then I've got Pam a little something as well and I put Pam's in the bag because it was too small to wrap. We're just waiting for the limo. Come up now. By the way, I'm not, not having my hair like this. I'm just keeping I'm it. Always like this. They're gonna cry. They are gonna cry. I just don't know where it's gonna mark. Maybe it could be there actually. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god! Oh my god! Yeah! Oh my god! Oh Anna! It's amazing too! It's <laughs> She's got a granny for a granddad for a granddad. <laughs> and Yana! I am Nanny. I'm surprised for you both. Oh, Anna! I just can't believe that. Oh my god. All them years, you pay, all them years ago, you paid for the oh. limo for us all, didn't you? And you oh. got it back. I said you'd cry. Oh, oh no. Right, Here is our limo for the day. Oh my, oh my god. god. Oh my god. Anna, what have you all done? I don't know. Anna, but it's even bigger than I am. It's what huge. Do you remember? Oh my god. We're just getting some photos in front of the limo. Are you excited? So excited. It's oh, so sick. I can't believe it. I'm still. Like, what a lovely shop. shop. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> what a Oh my god guys, here is the limo. This is incredible. What the hell? Come round here Danny, we're all gonna sit on the sofa. Here are all the drinks, we've got some champagne. Oh look at that, we've got to have a little drink of champagne. Oh Nanny, of course we'll have some champagne. Have a taste. Mum is trying to open the um the champagne. Look at that. I really don't know. Oh god. Hey, come on. Oh my god! Oh my god! Right, the corpse here now. Right. Oh my god! I think personally, it'll just be a little pop. Twist it. Twist it. Yeah, twist it really slowly. I think if it. And if it's not, I've got a plan. I'm just gonna put it in that direction. Dave, I can't do it. Come here. She can't pop it. Can you pop? Can you pop her? I think we should get Dave to do it when we stop. I really do. Is this it? Yeah. I'm just trying to get a good feel. <laughs> you will when you get the bubbles. <laughs> you know what? I wish I'd never asked. Oh God, it's coming, it's coming. <laughs> yeah. Don't do it where the glasses are. I'm putting my scarf on. Oh God. How it out so easy in your hands and it'll be like, it will do. What was yeah. all that? Yeah, what was all that? Yeah, what was all that? It feels that it's going to just come out. Do you want me to do it? No, Dave, I've nearly done it. <laughs> Dave, you'd be better to it. <laughs> no, I've nearly done it. Yeah, it's, it's, it's nearly there. It's nearly there. Are you sure? Yeah. Dave, 
grapes. This must be the slowest you've ever seen the champagne pot. <laughs> uh, let's <laughs> visit. <laughs> How many people does it take to pop a cork on the champagne? Oh! Yeah. 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 Oh. Oh. Jesus. That's the first champagne you've caught. Oh. We've uh, got our champagne. champagne. Mum's not, but Pam and Nan have got some. Cheers, Pam. <laughs> now we're just saying she's had champagne since the millennium. The millennium. So 20 yeah. years. Yeah. But well worth the wait. This is exactly. Yeah. It was my oh, first vodka and lemonade. Only. <laughs> no, first gin and lemonade. Gin and lemonade. Which we've got a load of for later. No, no, we're going the Tipsy. We have arrived in London and this is the view from our hotel. So you've got Tower Bridge just here. You've got the Tower of London, which is right there. Nan, Pam and Mum absolutely love it. Oh my God. Oh, oh here is one of the bedrooms. And then look at the bathroom. Oh, so nice. Double shower. Look at the view. So this balcony, I can go here in the morning. Yeah. I'm really struggling with these curtains, I know, I'll be honest. No, you move them from this side. Oh, wait, I'm confused. Yeah. We just have to figure out how to do it. Yeah. But there we go. Look at that. So, this is our room. We'll the and then let's go either. into, I think this is going to be Nanny and Pam's room. Single beds, little dining, not a dining room, dressing table. Then we've got the family bathroom, which is over here, which I think has got a bath in. Yes, here we go. Cute little plant here. Hi. <laughs> and then you've got like utility cupboards. This is the living room here. It's beautiful. And then this is the kitchen. So we've got a whole island. Mum's very happy because we've got a coffee machine. What designer shower gel is it? So Sinful Delights actually made you all some desserts. So Nanny, look. She's got a big brownie with your name on it. Oh, wow. Look, oh, Wendy. Yeah. And Pam, she's done you one oh, as well. That is oh, you're so oh, Look, wait. Oh, I can't get it off. Look, there you go. Oh, she was saying to me, like, oh, How cool. That is That's Rocky Road, and then that's Brownie. Oh, and then we've also got a treat oh, box up there as well. Oh, thank you, Anna. Thank you so that's okay. Much. Thank you, Sinful Delights, for helping oh, us do it. Oh, that, that is, is so lovely. lovely. It's so nice, oh, isn't it? Well, I've never had one with my name on. Neither have I. I am now already, my nan just said, everyone got dressed up and everyone has got really dressed up i'm going to show you my outfit in the mirror now we are just still all in awe over this incredible incredible view here is my play suit it is from pretty little thing and i got it in a sale it's actually meant to be sheer but i had to put a top underneath it and as you can see there's a little bit like missing at the back because it's meant to be backless but i just didn't know what to do because obviously i needed to put a top underneath it i just recurled my hair and now it's all curly it just redid my makeup and i'm going to get out my bag here i bought my chanel bag so my super special bag that i use for really special occasions it is one of my actually it's probably my favorite bag in the world and i just love taking it out on super special nights so i'm gonna repack this and then we're pretty much ready to go. I'm on the balcony, we've just taken some photos. So if you do wanna see them, head over to my Instagram, but we are now gonna head out to dinner. We're going to Angus Steakhouse in Leicester Square, which is gonna be so nice. And then we're gonna to head to the theater to go and watch Mamma Mia. Here is our food. I've got a fillet steak, and then I got peppercorn sauce, mac and cheese, sweet corn. Mum got a beef salad. Pam got a sirloin. And then Nan got fish and chips. This looks amazing. We are in the taxi. We've just finished our meal. Did everybody enjoy it? And it was Oh, it's amazing. So amazing. You're amazing. welcome. It's we are lovely. now on our way to theatre. We were going to walk, but it's a 12 minute walk and I'm not very good with it's maps and don't cold. know what direction. And it is pretty cold, so we just hopped in a taxi, but we've still got 50 minutes, no, only 50 minutes until it starts. So we're going to go in there and then I'll show you the theatre when we get in there. We have just arrived at the Mamma Mia theatre. We got here quite early and we didn't realise there's so many people already going in, but everyone is so excited. Here is the stage. We're all sat in the theatre and we've got our tickets for half an hour. Oh, it's not even focusing. Hang on. We've got a half an hour till the show starts. Good morning, everyone. Look how amazing the view is in the morning. I forgot to show you guys last night, but it is just phenomenal. I don't think I've seen a prettier view of London than this. I am currently cooking everyone's breakfast. We are doing like a full English type thing. So I've got some mushrooms going. I am just cooking the bacon and I'm going to cook some eggs as well. And I've also got in the toaster 
some more toast going. I am enjoying cooking way too much. I've got my bacon in here. I'm just cooking some tomatoes and mushrooms up. This is honestly so much fun. Here's Nanny's breakfast. Here's my breakfast. I don't know what happened to the egg. Here's my breakfast for you. Yes. Oh, oh Anna, that is so lovely. Come here, my darling. I've got you two other things. What? I'll give me a kit. Yeah. I love that. Darling. I've got you two other things. Oh, I love that, Anna. I'll give you I this love one. That one. Oh, oh, that is gonna oh, look so nice. nice. I'll give you this one first. Yeah. Oh, I love that, Anna. Thank you. That's okay. Oh, bless your heart. Thank you. There's this one too. Oh my God, Anna. <laughs> I've got you a little present, Pam, there as well. Oh, oh you're joking. It's just there. Oh. I was meant to give you them yesterday, but I forgot because oh, I had to hide them as soon as we got here. Oh, Anna, what are you oh, doing here? <laughs> Toiletries, are they? Yeah, it's a sanctuary spa set. Oh, I love sanctuary. I know. I've got Libra. Oh, Anna, I <laughs> love oh, Sanctuary for ages. Turn it upside down, Nanny, and then lift the lid off. Oh, this is it. so cute. It's cute, That's isn't it? Edition, it's so cute. It's beautiful. It's oh, so nice, girl. isn't it? Thank you. Oh, You're welcome. Oh, oh, my sanctuary. Oh. What did I say to you the other week? Yeah. My, my toiletries that I love is sanctuary. Yeah. It's not like a This is so cute. I it's love so it. cute. Do you know what, Anna? One of these surprises oh. coming to an end. <laughs> What surprise are you? Do you know what? You've got, got that's your body cream. Yeah. You've got a bath soap. You can use that shower gel. So that's oh, the wow. body. That candle's yeah. so nice, yeah. isn't it? It's yeah. beautiful. Washing yourself. Oh, yeah. And then so this here, yeah. fill this, oh, fill this one. Yeah. That is for your feet. Oh, is it? Yeah, it's for your feet. Oh, that's oh. a lot. I love this stuff, really. Yeah. I can smell it. I absolutely. Have you ever had sanctuary? Thank you so much. You're welcome. Oh! <laughs> I did wrap it, but Anna, I love sanctuary. You got one. Oh, I'm one. glad. Oh, I'm just over the moon with that. Oh, oh lovely. I love them. So I'm, I, I'm so thrilled with that. I've only had one lot in all my life. Oh, yeah. A oh, sanctuary. Yeah. And, and I love it. Yeah, that one. Oh, look at it in the heart. It's oh. beautiful, isn't it? Never I know what she's got <laughs> me. <laughs> I am gonna, this is like yeah. gold. <laughs> So you've got a, you've got a big one and you've got a oh. hand one. So everyone, we are just sat in the apartment. We've got about 20 minutes before we need to leave. Our taxi isn't picking us up until two o'clock today. So we're gonna figure out which way is best to walk. And we're gonna walk, it's gotten so busy down there. London on a Sunday, I feel like it's busier than any other day. Uh, so we're gonna find which way to walk and we're gonna go find a nice little place for lunch, walk past the Tower of London. We wanna try and find a souvenir shop so we can get something for Atticus because Atticus obviously hasn't been here the whole weekend. So we wanna get him a little bus or something and find somewhere to eat food. We are coming for our first ever wagon mummers and we've walked in, it says from bowl to soul. Mummy's like, yeah, that's a bit of me. Of course, we all went for the katsu curry and we got some pulled pork dumplings and then we're just waiting for the other sides to come over. And I'm now home. It is actually the next day and honestly, we had one of the best trips. Like, it honestly couldn't have gone any better. My nan, Pam, my mum were just so happy and we've never gone away for like a girls weekend before. Atticus actually went and stayed at his dad's for three days and he loved it as well. He had so much fun. He's actually at school right now, but we just... I can't even explain how much fun we had. Like, seeing Mamma Mia, I don't think we actually filmed a clip, like, explaining how good it actually was, but the whole of Mamma Mia was, oh my god, like, breathtaking. Donna's voice was just something else. It was, like, a pure, meant for West End type of voice. Do you know what I mean? Like, it was just amazing. And then the dance along that we did at the end, like, Mamma Mia is one of their favourite movies, so it was so good. The place we stayed in, I just absolutely loved it. So, I am going to end this vlog here. I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please smash a huge thumbs up. And other than that, I will see you very soon for a brand new video. Mwah. Bye!